The approach to food safety in the aquaculture industry is to control it at each step of the production chain. At each step in, from the hatchery to the farm, including inputs from the feed, and then at the processing plant, at each of those steps, there could be a food safety impact. And so every step needs to be controlled. Well, food safety um, in the aquaculture space is, is really about controlling three basic types of risks. You have microbiological risks, uh, you have chemical risks, and you have contaminant risks. So the method they use to control those risks has to do with using HACCP principles, hazard analysis, uh, critical control principles, to assess and figure out con preventive controls for those risks, and then you add to that good manufacturing practices, sanitation and hygiene procedures, um, training for the staff, medical checks, and um, verification testing, which is lab testing. Seafood is one of the safest proteins available. There was a Center for Disease Control, CDC report, looking at statistics for foodborne outbreaks in the United States from 2009 to 2015, and there were something like 26,000 foodborne outbreaks in the United States. And of those, 52% were related to land animals, 37% I believe were, were, was related to plants, and 9% was related to seafood. So seafood's really one of the safest foods we have available. It's no coincidence that the U.S. government dietary guidelines uh, were revised in 2015 to 20, doubling the amount of seafood that we should eat every week because of its healthfulness. There always uh, are ways to improve on food safety and the challenge is to, once again, to work at each point in the production chain to make sure that safety issues are addressed. That includes both pathogens like salmonella or listeria that can cause bacterial disease, and also contaminants, um, chemicals or residues that can exist in the final product. And consumers can be confident that they're getting the right kinds of seafood by looking for the BAP certification label on packaging because BAP, to our knowledge, is the only certification program that actually samples and tests the final product from every production facility every year, both for pathogens and for residues.